It's 2 30 in the morning, y'all. I'm going on a little random little run, you know. I used to do this when I was like high school and college and all that. But it I don't know if it feels good to be in my thirties and and able to get up and go outside and go for a run and feel good and even though I'm in pain right now, because you've been paying attention, I've been doing a lot of running lately. Getting back to being me, man. Running really saved me. Anyway, I started this video to not talk about me. But, ooh, it's a possum over there. It's a possum over there, Grizzly. You see a possum running right there? Yeah, Mr. N Zero Prey Drive. Mr. It's, it's a possum, literally. Just running. You know, possums are extremely slow. But anyway. That goes into my point. Um, whenever you take prey drive from a dog, whenever you want, you, you know, you want to bring them down to the the most family centric as can, as can be, the fa most family friendly, random friendly dog as can be. Um, you take a lot of that, a lot of that prey drive out. Then you get a dog like Grizzly. Grizzly, let's go. Then you get a dog like Grizzly. And um, the only reason I'm calling him because he's exhausted. And when dogs get exhausted, they just get to doing whatever they want to. And they got to get back in their head a little bit. But, um, yeah, the dude is top, man. And he's holding me back on my runs. And it's like, damn, I want a dog I can run with, right? Like, I want, I want a dog that I can go on these runs with and be able to keep up. And I had dogs like that until I threw Roxy in there. Who was his grandma? Roxy. Every other dog in that lineup could keep up with runs, had prey drive, but Roxy. Roxy had zero prey drive. And uh yeah, he got the bones his grandma got. And he got the he got the the same little attitude too. You know, Roxy one of them dogs, she go all by herself, she don't really do too much, she don't let dogs bite on she'll snap. He the same way. One of the dogs go out by himself, the dog get on him, he ain't finna play it, he gonna snap. He is Roxy. Alright, so when y'all when you when you hear Roxy 2.0, it's it's literally grizzly. And uh he wanna be right by you. He wanna be able to keep up. He just he don't got the frame. He too wide in the shoulders, like his grandmother. And he just don't got the stamina, man. He just his bones are big. He, you know. It'd be different if he was like six months, six, seven months. I'm like, all right, cool. Boom, 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 right? But nah, this dude is going to a year and a half. You know what I'm saying? And the boy just, boy, break look. He snore when he sleep. Yeah, I thought, I ain't gonna lie. This is all trial and error, bro. Like, like, I was just saying how I got one of the perfect dog, or the boom, boom, and then I tested him to do some extra, and then I realized that he can't even, he ain't that. You know what I'm saying? Like, if I go jump in the lake, Grizzly ain't finna come jump in the lake. Like, I don't got Grizzly doing that. Now, have I tried that and see if he'll do it? No, I haven't. But what I am knowing and learning about Grizzly is Grizzly a thinker. You know what I'm saying? He a thinker. He he ready out the risk factor, so he's smart. And most people know some of the smart dogs ain't really with all this. If it ain't like something that, you know, huh, they ain't really finna do it. So and then Grizzly is a loner too. Like he don't want he don't want friends. He just he just want me. So um yeah, we got to get, you know, I told y'all it's going to take 10 years, man. This year five, all right? This year five, look at the boy all the way back there. Come on, man. The boy beat to my, I ain't even like, I'm not even at a quarter of what I'm trying to, to accomplish. You know what I'm talking about? Like, I'm not even at a quarter of what I'm trying to accomplish on this little run, on this little 2 a.m. run. And 
I'm a hallway down the block and I'm having to wait two to three minutes for him to catch up to where I am. You know what I'm talking about? And that just don't, that ain't gonna work. That ain't gonna work for me. So now when I'm going on my runs, I can't take him with me. You get what I'm saying? Look. I gotta take him on walks. You know what I'm talking about? I gotta take bro on walks. Can't go on runs. Not like this. If I'm just doing some chill stuff and come on, Grizzly. If I'm just doing some chill stuff and I just wanna got them going on the little on the little walkie walk. Cool. Come on boy. But when I'm going on my runs, I can't take them, so I gotta uh Cool, man. All right, I'm starting to get to the point where I'm thinking, you know what's crazy? And now I'm not even mad at Grizzly. I'm, not, I'm more so disappointed in the ego that human beings have. Like I just had a real human being moment of, who do you think you are? Like. How do you think you're gonna get everything you want down to the T in one animal and it ain't a perfect human in the world? How do you think you have a perfect dog? You can't, y'all can't out of thousands and millions of years of human beings, y'all ain't created that yet. And it's 2024, we still trying to create the perfect. You ain't no such thing as a perfect dog, man. Grizzly perfect for what he perfect for. And if I wanna be out here running like I'm trying to do a marathon, I need to go get me a dog that can do that. All right, he ain't gonna be able to do that. And now I know, I really know now. But he a good family dog, good dog walk trails with. Just wanna hang out, you know what I'm saying? Go on a trail. You wanna run a little bit and stop and walk, cool. Perfect dog, perfect dog to go camping with. Like when I go camping, when I take him up north, this winter, when we go up north, we are gonna go camping, perfect. Perfect camping dog, all that good stuff, yeah. Quiet, ain't finna do too much. Yeah, perfect camera dog. Perfect. But when I go on my runs and, and you know, shit like that, I'm gonna have to get a different type of dog. So put in the comment section uh, what type of dog you think EJ finna get next to, to help him. Not even to help him, but just to join him on this run, on, on this running journey, because I'm taking this running shit serious. I'm taking it 100% serious. I wanna do marathons and all that. So. What type of dog you think I should get? Put in the comment section. Like, comment, subscribe. Catch y'all in this video. Love y'all.